phobia technique is a submodality technique designed to get rid of a phobia in 20 minutes, but it does so much more than that. We use the fast phobia model to help people get rid of memories that may be traumatic for them. We can use it to help people get rid of things like PTSD. There are about 5 million people in the UK that have a phobia. If anybody's had an event in their past that maybe constantly plays on their mind, then the fast phobia is brilliant. The principle of the fast phobia is this. Someone has an event that causes them some level of problem, i.e. it has some negative emotions attached to the memory. And what we do with this technique is we have a way of rubbing the negative emotions off the memory. We don't delete the memory, the memory is still there. It just doesn't reappear in the present day with the same kind of negative emotions as it has had before. I used to have a snake phobia, uh, so I know exactly what it feels like. When I was a young kid, I ran into my uncle's lounge and there was a snake on the carpet. He has two snakes in tanks, I knew that, but I was so excited to tell him what had happened at school that day, and I ran into the house, flung open the door, and there's a snake, and I'm like screaming, and I'm running out. So significant emotional events are things that often will trigger phobias in our unconscious mind, where neurology, our mind, doesn't have time to adjust, so I went from being really excited to terrified, like in a split second, and it was enough to install a phobia. So if you want to be able to help people get rid of those kinds of uh, phobias um, in about 20 minutes, great, great little technique, very easy to do. So Gaina was a wonderful woman that came on the course. She had a fear of bridges. So what are you like, like on a scale of zero to 10, where 10 is the most traumatic and zero is on an entity, if you have to drive over the seven bridge, how's that for you? An eight out of 10. Oh yeah. That's gonna cause you a significant problem. It really stops people living their lives. And when you live in Wales, like Gaynor does, there's a lot of bridges because we've got a lot of valleys. So what I'd like you to do is I'd like you to teach me how to do this bridge thing. When we look at the strategies, the process that someone runs in their mind, when it doesn't work well, it's often very long and very complicated. And this is why it all goes astray. As come up to a bridge. Yeah. It's my hands start to sweat. Turn the music up. Yeah. What they need is a very short, simple strategy, which we can install after. Do you remember the time when you have done it the worst, as in it's oh, most? Yeah. Okay, yeah, fine. Yeah, yeah. So we'll use that movie then, all right? Yeah, okay. okay, good stuff. The fast phobia model requires us to run movies in our mind. We run the movie forward in a very specific way, black and white, so they can see themselves in the movie, in order to reduce the feeling that they have. When you're running the movie backwards, you're running backwards, so it's quite funny to watch yourself when you're doing the technique. People find it quite a fun way, and I tell them we're going to have a bit of a giggle, getting rid of a phobia or a fear that you have. Yeah, totally we can. We've heard from Gaynor since leaving the course, and she's loving it, because she now drives straight over bridges and doesn't give it a second thought. So, on a scale of 0 to 10, where 10 is highly traumatic, and 0 is a non-entity, where are you now? Zero! Oh, yay! <laughs>